going to write a traffic light program, so this is going to need to make use of inputs and a uh, decision option. So the flowchart is going to be that the green light is on until the button is pressed. When the button is pressed, the yellow light comes on, and then the red light comes on to stop traffic. All the pedestrians cross, and then you go back to the green light being on again. So I'm going to start with my output. I'm going to have the green light on and other lights off. What I type in here has absolutely no effect on the program, it's just for my own reference. And then I want the program to look at the input and make a decision based on whether the button has been pressed yet. So looking at your pick, you'll see that input 3 is the button. So I'm going to put that to 1. So this is asking the question, has the button been pressed? So this is going to ask the question, has the button been pressed? If it has, it's going to do one thing. If it's not been pressed, it's going to do something else. So if it has been pressed, I want the green light to go off. I want the yellow light to come on. And I want that to wait for two seconds. seconds and then it'll cycle back. So I'm going to connect up my cells now. The important thing is the first arrow that I draw from the decision will be yes. So if the button is green pressed, if it's yes, I want it to follow this path. If the button has not been pressed, I want it to loop back around and keep the green light on and then we need to connect this up here so now the program is going to leave the green light on it's going to ask the question continuously has the button been pressed if not the green light is going to stay on if the button has been pressed it'll turn the green light off as it follows this path here so if I go to the digital panel and run the flow so you can see the green light is staying on until I press the button which is on input 3 and it runs through that cycle. So once again I'm going to simulate that so I can check that that really does work. So there's the simple pick. There it is. I'm going to connect the power. I'm going to connect the download cable just by clicking on those. I'm going to click here to program pick. Next up download. So now the green light is on, and here's the button here. When I press that button, green light goes off, yellow light comes on, red light comes on, and then back to the green light again. So I'm sure that my program works. So now I'm going to plug my real chip into my cable and use this button here to program 